Mm. Anyway, so okay, we're gonna talk about the basketball thing first, whatever. Um, so now that basketball season back in the road, whatever, all star season over with. No, that's over with it, but I don't know. But no, I don't care about who winning, bro, because that's that's whatever. But like, what do you feel about like the lack of interest in the NBA specifically for like the regular season? Because I've been hearing like, even though it's bigger than it's ever been, it's, it's got more media attention than it's ever had. I constantly hear fans like complaining about like. For one, players not playing games, the all-star game boring, um, this lack of effort, whatever. Like, how do y'all feel we can help? Like, they can change that. Or should it be changed? I don't know as much as helping the all-star game. Because when you, because they, like, it's a break. I think, and, and, and that's what players use it as. You know, it's all-star. You might say all-star break. break. And you give them, like, a week off. They're not really trying to. I don't yeah. think they're really trying to play like a game full intense when they have a break or Oh, how y'all thought about the slam dunk? Something is for to me. Where yeah. goal is a championship. Killed that shit. I just think their goal is a championship and you give them a like a break of like a week. I mean, anybody's gonna take a break mm-hmm. for a week and wanna relax their whole body to go twenty something more games to try to finish the race out. Right. And then you still have to go win sixteen more. Right. Win sixteen more, not even play sixteen more, but I don't know, that's just from a podcast I've heard. I like heard it like recently. That's why I kind of bring it up. But mm-hmm. like, um, okay, but you you said how do you feel about slam dunk contests? No, I even most specific about slam dunk contests. Contest. How do y'all care about like the lack of stories in it? Like, like it's, I think it's, it does it does hurt because you know we it has you know, like I I've grown up and I wanted to always see LeBron James in it. Of course, yeah, he's and, like one too. I think LeBron the reason this young guy screwed because like that's that's awesome. he's, he's the biggest star. Like Jordan did it, Kobe did it. Kobe did it, right? Yeah, Kobe yeah, did Kobe it. Did. So, like, all the stars have done it, and then it's just like, like you had it. Yeah, well, so LeBron like, didn't do it, Russell didn't do it, John had But done honest, it. Zion. Zion, while LeBron is like part of the issue with the slam dunk contest, is when he didn't do it, it's like, he's the biggest big, 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 star all the yeah, time. He's the biggest like, star ever. If he can't do it, you can't. You I can't, can't I'm going to do it. Yeah, I, I get that, you know. Right. But, like, I but just, I just have an issue with that. I just feel like after that, that, uh, Aaron Gordon and Zach Levine don- t- uh-huh. contest, and that was a crazy one. Right? Mm-hmm. Ever since then, it just hasn't been. Mm-hmm. But I see they're trying to switch it up as far as like, like the skills challenge. Right. trying to bring teams into it. Rookies. I don't know if it brings so much to it though. I personally don't care about like all this stuff because it's all stuff. Right? I just like yeah. enjoy it. Yeah. Like I just, people, people might make it too much what it is. Right, they act like they want them to see an actual game like it's gonna matter at the end of the day. Like, but I'm just here for regular. Se- I don't really care about the regular season. I, I like I get what they're saying though, because when you think about it, like when you saw Kobe play mm-hmm. and like they're actually playing hard, like you right. got your best players and you want to see them go crazy. But like, I don't right, know. it's just nowadays it's just like. But when it comes to regular season, and they're talking about players resting. I see that as an issue in like more like we kind of play a part in that by we I mean the fans mm. when the highlight like the the Instagram social media came out and whatever and all you post in is you're a loser if you don't win you Russell Westbrook breaking records still getting hated on still like and he he always gives a hundred percent effort every time he plays still getting torn up so I mean if I've seen a player oh, get a hundred percent effort no and still getting drugged yeah. why am I giving effort? Don't bring my guy into this. Well, I'm just saying, that's the perfect example. I like it, 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 no it, is, it is like, but at the same time, it's like, I don't know. I get where some players are like, oh, like, we got to play. Like, mm-hmm. you know, as far as a fan standpoint, right. they don't get money like how we do. They don't yeah, get the I opportunity to be there. And I get the opportunity, but at the same time, like, I think everybody's such in a mindset of like, this like this regular season really don't mean nothing. Right. Like the main goal is when we get into that playoffs, and I'm playing every single. Mm-hmm. I'm playing every single game. Hurt. So I just think that's where it comes in at. I mean, I don't know if they'll play or put like a restriction on it. But I feel like they might in the future. I, I can't see that happening. Like low management. Oh. Um, <clears throat> on load management, like I feel like if you miss more than two games and not having like a, a like a serious injury that has been probably like. Shown in a game, mm-hmm. what are you sitting out for? Because you know people, people be like, ah, Mike or, you know what I'm saying, coach, I'm sitting out this game, 
And it's just like, oh, okay. so like they had like a three game like road trip or something. Like if he misses two of those games or something, yeah, they get fine. They but get like, fine. I feel like that still might not make it because you know people got money. No, because I think the player association gonna step in like, nah, bro. We need. I mean, and the reason I say we did is because when you make a championship robust, like yeah. even today, like it's all about championships. Why you think we still defending Michael Jordan? Like, yo, he got six championships. How many rings LeBron got? How many rings I, Curry got? I just don't think you can ever bring that championship up, like as a criteria how good you are, because. But that's what they're doing. I mean, but even if you say that, then you really have to say Bill Russell's the best player. He has eleven of them. But you know that that's different. Cause that's like yeah, but then people always 18. say that's different. So, but, but so like don't say like, use that criteria. You can't have a criteria and then be like rings or like oh, I understand the rings the most important thing because that's what the whole season's about. Because you and I get Michael Jordan went six and zero, but right. like this man Bear also has five more than him. Yeah, I get that, but I'm just saying for like players who don't have a ring, like for example, Dame is my favorite player in the league right now. Dame is, but they always say Dame is not a top five point guard. Why, in the why? in the in the, in the yeah, NBA yeah. right now, right or just. All time, right now, obviously all time. I'm, I might, he, I don't know if he's top ten. He might Ooh, be top, who top five point guard right now. Steph. Well, no, me personally, I think he's number three. But okay, I think but Steph, just, just name him. Steph, um, Kyrie. No. I, I, I've always thought Dame was better than Kyrie. Okay, <coughs> so okay. Luka, point guard? Technically, but I guess if you want to count. Him. Okay, so you got Steph, Luka, Steph, Luka, Dame, Dame for Kyrie. Me. I don't think Ja is Ja is probably the fifth. Trey Young, I think Ja better than Trey. Trey Young, Ja, they kind of interchangeable for me. I mean, uh, Shea Gill getting up there, but he probably like outside the top think, five. Right I don't now. think Shea top five. He outside right top. Now. He definitely top ten. Right Darren now. Fox is making the case for himself, but he's still outside the top five right now. Man, that man yeah, I think it'd have to be in the Ja Trey to get busy though. But I'm just saying, like people are hating on him because he hasn't won a championship. I and I I get that because it's. I get that on my guy. Russell yeah, Westbrook. exactly. But like, <clears throat> I don't know. I just feel like if you're gonna say what a criteria is, you have to list it out and be sticking to it because everybody right. else goes back and forth about it. Oh, he don't have a championship, so he goes below this guy, but he has championship. So, but like, then you say that with Jordan, and then you bring up LeBron, and you don't bring up Bill Russell. Right. But Russell's like nobody's like top ten player. <laughs> I don't okay. say that out loud. <laughs> I'm just saying though, like yeah. if you if you hear top ten, they, they barely right. even say Bill Russell, and That's he has true. eleven. That is true. So like, he not in my top ten personally. Well, let me tell you that he, he not, not, he he not, not, about me. He not in my top ten personally. But if I was to do errors, he would be top ten. Because if I'm Kevin Durant, doing, doing an error, yeah, he's he's he, he, he he dominated. Number one, number one basically. But like, damn, Ooh. I don't know. If error like. Saying like who the best player in the NBA or the best player that's ever played the game is very like crazy to say. Like, there's been so many greats. Right. I mean, do you think do you think fans overvalue championships? <clears throat> um, I think it comes with certain players, like who they're talking about. I, I, so like, I can see that. So like, they might have be biased towards some people. Okay. And then be like, oh, man, I like him, so he gets a knock over this dude. Why? Because you like him or something like that. Okay. Yeah, if you're gonna make a list, make that's what I'm saying. You're gonna have, you're gonna need a criteria, but like you have to stick to it. It's yeah, if you make a list, of course we're gonna put like our favorites in there. And if that's the case, there's nothing wrong with that. Just say this is my list about who I like, not based on like if they're good.